TikTok, I really need your help. If you're new here, this is a photo from my troubled teen facility I was sent to where I was abused and tortured. Um, this is the bucket they would make girls go to the bathroom in, and there's the toilet paper. CPS investigated them for this bucket, and I need to know if any medical professional, any psychology, anybody has ever heard of this, and if this is a legitimate thing. So the owner said to CPS, since we deal with sexual abuse victims, a very common symptom is a fixation with their bowels and bladder as well as genitalia. In order to assess these symptoms accurately to see if this is a medical or mental health treatment issue, we need a clearer picture. Even though the bucket has rarely been used, it is an effective assessment tool. Therefore, I would like to keep this assessment tool, but change it to a portable commode. TTS will use portable commode only to be used to assess gastrointestinal or genital urinary health of a client if no other means have been effective. The portable commode will be cleaned by the client after each use the same way the toilets are cleaned. Wearing gloves, the client will dump the contents into the toilet and then clean and disinfect it immediately. Okay, is this a legitimate treatment thing? Is this ever used anywhere? This is a nurse who said this. I need to know.